Uh, I just thought I'd show you uh, a repair we're doing on the farm to a 3130 tractor. Basically, he had a fault in the uh, gearbox and that we couldn't get uh, reverse or high ratio. And uh, so we thought we'd uh, take the top off. Well, after getting the top off, uh, we had a look in, and uh, it's basically obvious that this uh, bolt here had uh, snapped off and uh, in a blind hole. So I've managed to get the bolt out, and it's a countersunk head, and that had fallen in. And I fished around in there, in here, with a magnetic uh, probe thing, couldn't find it. And then I thought I'd undo the bung and try and fish around with a bit of wire. When I undone the bung, it fell out the bung, so I had a bit of luck there. So I found both sides of the bolt. Now this is the uh, old uh, part and the old uh, broken bolt. It's a countersunk head, and that went in there. I don't know whether that that come loose or. or Anyway, they've broken off. I managed to find that, managed to get this out, and that seems to be the early version. And this, we thought we, you can still buy the countersunk head, but we thought we'd upgrade to the later version. So we bought a new one of them, a new bolt, because this hasn't got a countersunk head. And it's got this uh, lock in tab here, it locks it, and we're going to put some thread lock on the bolt as well. So it'll be the same as the later 3130s had this and the early ones had this as obviously had a fault with it. Uh, well I've now um, put the new uh, part on with the new bolt and the little uh, tab thing. I wasn't sure which way around that was so I put it like that. It doesn't really tell you in the parts book or the workshop manual which way around it goes, but I, I couldn't see other way it went around, so I put it that way around. And uh, now we operate the gear lever. First, low ratio, reverse, and high ratio. That's high ratio, that's neutral, reverse, low, ra low ratio. So in theory, once you get it all back together and we start it up, it should work now. This little uh, thing here that pops up and down, that's the uh, safety switch. So you can't put it in gear. You can't start it when it's in gear. That connects to a safety switch on the rocker cover. a bit further on with the 3130 repair uh, we were about to pit um, the rocker cover back on and I noticed uh, one of the ram bolts was loose this bolt was loose so I went to tighten it up with a ratchet and um, guess what it snapped off and these are 12.9 grade bolts and uh, nothing will touch it so now we've got to take the ram off and then uh, try and uh, chisel the uh, stud, leftover stud, uh, leftover bolt round or, or weld something onto it so I can get it out. Because I've got to get the bolt out. Can't put it back on the tractor with a broken bolt. I'll give you an update later. I took the ram off and I uh, punched, the, managed to get a centre punch and move the stud slowly round and round after I've tapped it round and round about four times I managed to go over with my fingers so uh, we've just managed to uh, put the rocker cover back on the tractor uh, it took a lot longer than expected because you couldn't get the uh, the roller 
on a draft selector in line with the cat with the cam follower on the coming up from the gearbox we couldn't get it in line in the end we had to get a bit of string pulling the cam follower that way and another bit of string out through this hole here pulling the, the selector roller this way and a bit of a jiggly poke we managed to get it on there and now we can look through this hole you can actually see it looking through this hole uh, you can see it actually moving up I've just uh, started the uh, 3130 up and testing the gearbox up so I thought I'd take it for a run up the road with no cab, it's got no cab on so I've got the wheels right next to me